Hello, hello, this is Father Adam with some good news that I know you can use. I am sick and tired of people asking me, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? No, I'm not. And it's okay for me not to be okay. Hmm? How could I be okay? I just received news that I've been excommunicated from the church, from the Catholic Church. Uh, how could I be okay? After um, I was sexually abused and raped by a priest in Las Vegas. And then I had a um, horrible eating disorder that developed after that. That nearly killed me. The horrible depression that came in from that. I nearly died. How can I be okay when I was blamed? instead of helped in the church by the bishops in Las Vegas and in Santa Rosa, California, and by their vicars. Huh? I was blamed because, as they said, well, you know, we think you're homosexual or we think you're gay, so you probably, mm, you probably looked for this. <laughs> we don't believe you. I wasn't believed. I was blamed. I was filled with shame. Hmm? How could I be okay? And now I get the news that I'm kicked out of the church. Huh? How could I be okay? Hmm? How could I be okay? How can you be okay when you go through moments just like, or situations just like me in your life? How can we be okay? But you know what? The good news is we don't have to be okay. It's okay not to be okay. I don't have to be okay. Hmm? And you don't have to fix me because I'm not a broken toy to be fixed. Hmm? If you want to help me, accompany me, walk with me. That's what God does with me. Jesus walks with me hmm? and he walks with you and I walk with you. And I'm so grateful that you do walk with me that you haven't abandoned me. Mm -hmm. I don't need you to send me money. Because people say, well, what do you need? Uh, can I send you money? Can I give you things? No, I don't need your money and I don't need your things. I need you. Mm -hmm. And I don't need you to give me any advice. Because huh? there's nothing you can say that will make me feel better. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. No. I'm a depressed person. I suffer from what is called smiling depression. It's, you know, like what um, actors, different actors have, have uh, like Robin Williams. And the best thing for somebody like me, and I do take medicine, I'm, I'm walking, I'm, I'm, I'm part of the survivors club. <laughs> the best thing is to know that I'm not alone. And you don't have to give me any advice or fix me. You just have to be with me. And the way to be with me is to send me a nice message. Uh, put a like on the video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, at Adam Kotas Direct. Um, follow my Facebook. Yeah, that's, you just, you're letting me know I'm not alone. And that's what I need. I don't need stuff. And little by little, I'll be okay. I'll be okay. I'm not okay. But I will be okay. In God's time. Not in my time. Or your time. And that's what you need to do with your loved ones who are going through situations. Don't try to fix them or tell them, Oh, you know, be strong and all that. No. Walk with them. Huh? Accompany them. That's what God does with us. And that's what God calls us. Uh, to do for one another. And that's what I try to do for you. To walk with you all the time. Because I love you. And you don't pay rent. You live here in my heart and you don't pay rent. Hmm? And we're walking together. Huh? <sighs> and so put on that Bob Marley song. Hmm? Every little thing is gonna be alright. Baby don't worry. About a thing. Because every little thing 
It's gonna be alright Baby don't worry About a thing Cause every little thing Is gonna be alright God bless you I love you very much And you know love is Not giving Not to give But love is to open up That's the definition of love To open up That's why I open up with you because I love you. And I'm praying for you. And I know you're praying for me. Everything is going to be okay. One day. It doesn't have to be today. Huh? So it's okay to not be okay.